Alright, hello everyone, Stardust King here, and welcome back to Monster Sanctuary. We last left off getting our our ass handed to us by a uh, blue man over here. The Draco Bill? Is that his name? Draco Zeal. Zool. And we have two monsters to take care of. Three champions the world. We definitely can't beat him at our current rate. But, uh, I got some... Uh... Oh! My mic. Uh, my machine's going. I got some, uh, I guess some pointers on Team Synergy. I made me two teams. I've been wanting to make the Crit Master team for quite a while. See, this is my crit master team. I really haven't put any uh, weapons or anything on them at the moment. But this is basically what I want to do for this team. I went out and captured one of these. I just went around the, uh, the keeper's trail until I found an egg. Which really wasn't that hard. Also got a few more eggs. As you can see, Rocky, Vero, Mag and Pillar, Blob, Yowie. Unlike his, well, like his brethren for the most part, whenever he crits, he heals the whole party by 20% of damage dealt. So that's rather nice. And you, I've been wanting to put him on my team for uh, quite a while because he seems quite broken. TBH. But yeah, this is also my team. This is actually kind of based on his team for the most part that he was using whenever I, I, I uh, raided him. He was using the base version of this. A druid and uh, the red dragon. So I just took these two and I put this one on there because I feel like this is my synergy team for the most part. Dealing with buffs and healing. Speaking of buffs and healing, I need to put a shift stone on this guy. I didn't want to do it until I uh, finish this. But overheal, when an allied monster is getting healed above max health, convert 50% of that amount into shields. Eternal heart. That increases his damage substantially. Thirty-four. Oh my God, that's kind of broken. Yeah, yeah. This seems just seems seems rather good, honestly. I'm kind of interested in this right here. Bleed stacks on enemies are not removed when they take bleed damage, but I don't want to do anything to my champion monsters, generally because I'm not sure what happens. If I can get another egg or not, so I just want to leave the champion monsters right away. Faction of Ally. This seems good. It'll work on my synergy team really well. I'm kind of interested in getting freaking charged up. Increases damage dealt, reduce damage, and by uh, taking the mana cost by 1% for every charge set. This is rather good for him, honestly. I also want to. Uh, this. Light Instinct. I'm not even sure this this, this is makes everything so damn it changes the way you build your teams for the most part which I really do like I, I really like it accident thing light shift uh, all this good stuff we're not gonna go through all of them honestly but there's definitely some some unique abilities here, and I really do like them. Anyways, I really want him to be this one. So he actually looks like Solar now, but I think the equipment mastery will help him out a little bit more. 
And this is gonna be our team, our, our synergy team. As you can see, we're just gonna save it. I put equipment on them for the most part. I wasn't sure what to put, but as you can see, they are pretty strong. This is gonna be my backup team. Let's see how they fare against the champion, TBH. That's what I really want to know. Uh, he's not that hard. Yeah, let's do this. Alright. Let's do full protect. Uh, live channel. And support. Actually, let's do a uh, slime shot. I was really interested in seeing this team for the first time because he was removing all the debuffs and not taking any any health damage whatsoever. Which I really like. It was really strong. Let me see if overheal really does work. Ah, there it does. It, it, it works. It works nicely. Ice storm. You don't even have to worry about healing at the moment. Deep freeze. The reason why I thought the uh, the goat would be good for this. Is as you see there, he gets charged that, so he potentially can one shot things. Soul Beam. And he shares his charge sacks with other people too. So, I mean, why not? Let's do this one more time. Now we to technically have all the buffs in the game. Alright, just gonna tackle him. Why not? Let's actually start applying some damage. Uh, let's break his armor. Slime shot, fireball, slime shot. Let's do fireball. I mean, it's definitely not the strongest team. But it definitely doesn't die, I can tell you that. What happened to my guy's mana regen? It kind of sucks now, CBH. We need something that applies debuffs, CBH. If we had debuffs on this team, it'll be rather OP. Do you guys agree? Basically, do have all the uh, everything on. Actually, in a pretty good spot. Rather good spot, actually. I like it. And he's just gonna keep getting strong because his age stacks. Need to invest in some mana regeneration for you. Dbh. And this team doesn't die, Gates. So I better find myself in a, in a bad spot. I'm about to switch to this team. Yeah, 
Ja, das ist was für das hier. So, Bean, we should actually be able to kill him this turn. So now that we have it, like literally every buff in the game, I want to see how many points we get. We haven't even taken any health damage, so we should have 100% off. We're definitely not going to get execution bonus, I can tell you that. And then finish him off with a fireball. And miss, really. But it dies with poison. Okay, our healthiness was off the chain, but nothing else. It's actually fighting with my regular team. We still have the other members of the team, which I haven't done anything for. BBH. But that'll be fine for the time being. I want to try Crit Masters out, TBH. Master seem like they will be rather OP. If you ask me. Just gonna do everything I can to increase his crit chance at the very least. And crit chance, and then uh, what is it? Needle? Or is it Fang? Oh, wait. He doesn't even need the Shuriken. We'll probably do with the uh, the thing, the other thing, the guitar. Get the crit chance. What else? We need something with crit chance, mana crit chance. Ban ain't, uh, bandana ain't that bad. Let's see how this team stacks up against enemies. I have two skills for them. Okay. Not bad. I'm not even sure what I want now. It's very mana. So he has a 54 chance, so a 54% chance to crit. We have to apply bleed. Still, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Uh, let's try this against the uh, healing. Let's start off with uh, with ignite, I guess. You'll be asking, why is he on the Crit Master scene? Well, he does. He is kind of a Crit Monster, TBH. May not seem like that, but. Kind of is. Team isn't as strong as as of yet, but I can see it getting there. Slowly. Slowly but surely. One thing I refuse to do, and that's lose to a champion. Let's see, fire claws. Do air, do fire shield. Hmm. 
Yeah, if we had the what's his face? Oh, we died. Oh, Lord. I think we lost this. In the cards. I mean, we could potentially still win. But it's not likely. I'm not gonna go for it. I'm not gonna try to win. It really is possible, though. That Crib Masters isn't, aren't that strong at the moment. There's still a few more things I need to do with them. Especially you, you have no health. Jesus. Anyways, this is the old Keeper's Trail team. I'm gonna keep this team for a while. Let's uh, actually see if we can win. Actually, no, let's, 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 let's go somewhere else. There's a few places I want to go. So I want to see about that shift zone. There's definitely a shift zone in there. So we're going to try it. Why not? It's up one our mount. And speed away. Speed away. I've also been meeting a try if you beat a, uh, a what's his base? A champion monster? You uh, five star after you already got a deck, does it give you another monster? What other egg? I can't do anything about that. I'm saying what do you mean? Like you know how I've been five starring champion monsters this entire time? I'm wondering if I do that again on a champion monster already beat. Like this will give me an, uh, a shift today. Seems like an interesting question to ask. It's a uh, firestorm. You know, it's Gale. Bolts. And explosive blast. Thunderstorm. Another storm it is. And there's a reason why the birds aren't. Ooh, frosty egg. Soul Y. And now let's see. Koi, 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 where's Koi? We still can't go down there. Interesting. So we need to come down from below, it looks like. Sorry about the whistling. What did you like music in this game? So I guess now we have no other choice but to go to the uh, the beach. To the beach we go, boys. To the beach we go. Let's go back to our arms, though. So we can get around just a tiny bit faster. He's trying to speed run this game. I bet the arm tail will come in handy. Preferably use this because it's a lot faster than anything else. You wouldn't go down there like I just did. Anyways, we've done everything else. Let's go here so we can get the thing that breaks big blocks. Alrighty then, Koi. Give me power. So what do you do now? Lightning bolt still? Okay. Boy. Oh, 
Ooh, crabs. What are they weak to? Fire? Oh, you didn't fucked up now. You didn't fucked up now. You dare be weak to fire in my presence? That's all we do is fire damage. Fire blast or explosive blast if you're sweat to it out. Power slash. And it definitely hurt. That's different. Let's uh slime shot this one. They all should die and we should get five stars so we can get the little crap. Do do Let's get some to burn. There you go, that's what I can see. And he should die to explosive blast, and they both should die to the poison in slash fire on their bodies. There you go. Do, 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 do. Ten stars, and we got the you can egg. Dodo. Okay, choose monsters. So let's see, 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 let's do this team. So we don't really have to worry about, uh, what's the spaces as much. damage as much. A chill on one. Explosive blast. There we go. So we need one of these to get the shock hopper. So we definitely need to get two eggs here. Earthquake, spread the damage around. You can kill them all in the third turn. Mark Love, what's it in close to us? Yeah, they're all dying in the, in the second wave. Or the next round. I lied. Potentially. They, they all are potentially dying. We need to do like some serious damage to something. Focus on this. Okay, another ice storm. And yeah, they're all dead. We should get barely five stars. Mainly because of all the buffs we have on our people. And we get a, a dark shifted dodo egg. What more can you ask for? I'm pretty sure you can mount the thing. Oh, there's a buff. There's an item up there. Which you can't get. Monsters. Do, 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 do. Uh, let's do the same exact thing we just did. Earthquake. Do, 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 do. All right, we're gonna ice storm. Hope we get spread to chill. Doesn't seem like it. Explosive blast. Which 
Elf's level 3. Let's Earthquake again, because why not? Ice Storm. There you go, that's the two I wanted in the first round. Close to blast, we should be able to kill them all. Potentially. Ooh, close. Alright, so we're healthy. Let's go over here, let's explosive the blast so we can kill them in 2.33 turns. We get that dota away. Oh come on, you could have gave us a dota wick. How are you even supposed to get up there? I don't think it's possible with our current uh, stuff. Oh, I got a message. Let me go check that real quick. I'll be right back, you guys. But no, how are you guys... Well, if you guys have this game, are you guys enjoying it? I actually really do like it. I think it's one of those games that you can, uh, you know, suggest to everybody because it has so much content and it's... Oh, okay, Leonard. Hey, you again. Now you're at Horizon Beach already? How did you even get here in the first place? Also, don't you know monsters here are much stronger than the ones from Mountain Pop or the Blue Caves? You're gonna use stronger monsters if you're aspiring to even have a ghost of a chance of beating the monsters here. You can't just rely on your spec familiar. That's what really makes a great monster keeper, you know? I'd love to show you what a team of strong monsters look like, but I got some important missions to attend to. You see, there's an old man by the sea who's looking to hire some uh, experienced monster keepers for a treasure hunt. Of course you haven't heard about it because you don't even qualify. I want to Leonard. That's or it is more to a great monster keeper than having strong monsters. For instance, humility and sportsmanship. I'm sure Star will be allowed to participate in the treasure hunt as well. I suppose that's true. All right, you may try to follow and my lead star. Then perhaps you'll become a great monster keeper too. That's not really what I meant. Onward, the old man should be just by the seashore. I see he already, uh, Oh. Not what I was expecting. Welcome to. I see you already uh, shifted his monster in the sun. It's not a regular, uh, regular monster looks like. Regular version of the uh, spectral lying is red. Something above us. The map looks kind of weird. Nope, nothing at all. I really do want a spectral. Uh, this is actually a good team. Kind of. Only thing I don't want is this. Okay, let's uh, earthquake. Spread the damage around. Firestorm. Spread the damage around in the burns. And thunderstorm. There you go. It doesn't matter if he uh, take three turns. I always thought the only way to uh, guarantee five stars is with uh, I beat things in other three turns, but that's not the case. There are many, many other ways. We got some burn, we got thunder. Ooh, I can actually probably. We're not gonna do that though. Yeah, they're gonna die next turn. 
inch. Ow. Girl. Right, we're going to heal just a little bit. Earthquake. I just done this one. It's actually to be enough to take care of all of them. You want to die to fire? There you go. And we got 10 stars. Brawl's egg and a Yukon egg again. That's nice. I'm oh, sorry. This mailman's passing by. Let's see. He didn't bring anything. Okay. Old man by the seashore. Oh, by the sea. Well, hello there, young keeper. What a pleasant surprise. I was just looking out at the ocean and reminiscing about my family history. I can see you're the adventurous type who'd rather just go out there and live your own stories, but stay a while and listen, won't you? There might just be something in it for you. Hey there, Star. Did you come here to take some time off at the beach? What did you hear about the church around that's supposed to be happening around here, too? Fair right. I'm encouraging monster keepers to go looking for a treasure cave that I believe is hidden somewhere deep under the sea. But first, let me explain a little bit so you know I'm just not making all of this up. One of my ancestors actually happened to be a very well-known pirate influence across the ocean of the old world. This is around 300 years ago, and he was actually a monster keeper. You're probably wondering, how did he become infamous in the old world even though he was a resident of the monster sanctuary? Considering the barrier that separates us from the old world, which only very few keepers are allowed to cross on specific occasions, I'm telling you my ancestor had a ship that allowed him to cross the barrier freely at any time he was to do so. That and the fact that his whole crew was composed of monsters made him the terror of the old world seas. But eventually he passed on most of his treasures were never found. He did leave behind some clues for his descendants. Of course, our family has always kept the clues for themselves. But well, I decided I wanted to see the treasures uncovered before I pass on myself. My own children aren't really interested in it, so now I'm hiring any keepers who have the curiosity and able to find these treasures. And one of these treasures is the Sanctuary Token. Who knows what could be down there in the treasure cave. I do know for sure that there is a memorial ring down there with the ancient words of my family inscribed on it. So ancient in fact nobody in my family even knows the darn words anymore. That's all I really care about. Bring me the memorial ring. You can have whatever else you find down there. We're actually looking for Sanctuary Tokens, one of which could be somewhere at Horizon Beach. If it's rare or if it has any value at all, you can bet on it that my ancestor took it and hid down in this treasure cave. I see, it's probably worth investigating at the very least. As I say, my ancestor left behind some clues for us. For one, I'm pretty certain about the fact that the treasure cave is somewhere at a rising beach. He also left behind an encoded message, which I only recently got to fully encoded. It says, it takes three to enter the Mall of the Beast. I'm sure that must be the final hint necessary to find the entrance to this treasure cave. Oh, how intriguing. I'm sure we'll find that treasure. We should be able to find one of those sanctuary tokens in any case at least. Let's get going. We've got a lot of ground to cover. It takes three, which means Julia, Leonard, and us. By the way, there was another keeper who passed through just before you arrived here. He was quite eager and already went ahead. Alright, sounds fun. Let's try to find that treasure. Maybe we'll find it before Leonard and Julia. Come back. I'll give you a small word for it. Ah, I'm not doing your story again. Sorry, it was rather long. Koi, I choose you. Let us surf the seas together. Okay, we need something for that. It looks like you can encounter monsters in the sea as well. Yes, yes, the sea as well. Jeez. I guess this is our regular team. Poison. Don't ask me how fire storm works in the water. Maybe the fire is that hot. Oh, 
Oh. They hurt. They really hurt. They hurt, hurt, hurt. I was not expecting. I should have expected it, though. What is y'all down a third round, anyways? You just imagine how strong it'll be if I had Thunder Strike as AoE. We should be leveling up soon. Man, that was the weakest hitting wave I've ever seen. And then I guess our, our healing wave does the same amount of damage. We need to level up my slime healing. Alright, we may not be able to kill... We can kill the first one. Potentially the second one as well. Guess we can't kill any of them. Finish them off with Thunderstorm? Yes, we can. Potentially the crits. Yeah, crit. Sadly, no. So we're just gonna Arcane Bolt it. And make it all miss. It's gonna die to fire. Toxic Quiz Egg, level badge. We level up. Also, my. Yeah, these three, when I was running around, I was using the uh, the Crit Masters team, so that's why they are, you know, a little bit higher level. I didn't think it was gonna make that much of a difference, but I guess it did. Do, 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 do. What you talking about? Do, 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 do. What a okay. 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 This, this is necessary here anyways. Kind of broken. Okay. 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 Uh, I think fire shield is uh worth it. what I want from this guy. I think the monk was very good at the start. Like extremely good at the start. But now he's not good. He's definitely not as good as he was at the beginning. TBH. Like he's being outclassed by almost every every monster we come across nowadays. That's why I'm gonna have to start changing up my main team. That one goes in, this one goes down. That one goes down as well. Can't go there yet, can't go there yet. This one goes down. Up, this one goes down. Oh, that one also goes down. That's nice to know. This looks like a secret. Is it a secret? No, it's not a secret. Can you imagine if we somehow got here without boy? I don't even think we'll be able to make it here. It's 
chest. Double badge. Wasn't worth it. Alright, let's go to the left. I think that's literally the only way we can go, honestly. Let me restart my stream on my phone. There you go. Sorry, I'm just running into a wall because I was restart my stream. It's here. It's one of these things. I don't even know what the hell you are. Let's just fight it. Let's just find out. It is a Nautai. Debuffs. Win win. Okay. Seeing as you're weak to debuffs, might as well run. Okay, good, good, and then another storm level two. I mean, I really don't even have to do anything to that monster anymore. It'll literally just die by itself. Uh, heal wave, might as well. Right? Kind of interested. We can flat out potentially kill him if we crit. actually use Gil, but it really shouldn't matter because they're both dead anyways. Just get a heavy execution bonus for that. And we barely didn't get the uh what's his face? Let's uh assign some skills. Which one do we want first? Yes. Uh, my armor break. Do I already have that. Non damaging action. Interesting, at the very least. Alright. Somber defense proc. Make more damage. I think it's time for me to design a team that's meant for uh, the end game for the most part. Yeah, there was no way we could do this without Foy. Gotta take it slow. Go up, go over here. There you go. There's your chest, Phoenix here. Make sure there's no secrets there. Secret? Question mark? Nope. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
two traps. Ah, this leaks over to the fire area, it looks like. This. Earthquake. Second, we can just thunderstorm all the way. And you're almost dead. Crazy how that works. They love my bird, don't they? Poor Spectral Eagle. They actually should die this round, potentially. He spread the damage around just enough. Firestorm reveal. This is Firestorm. Yeah, it was definitely a good choice getting the Thunderstorm level 3. Level 2. They're gonna die to burn. Hopefully. There you go. Get another brawl. Hey, who's up there? Oh, it's you. Fate truly is a harsh mistress. I'm stuck down there. Faded to starve and complete isolation just when I think that I'm seeing a ray of light on the dark horizon. Don't listen to me, Joe. We can't get out of here on our own. Don't just rush into this bit like we did. You need to find monster. I mean, one that is capable of improving. Flying. It is true what my trusted companion is saying. For better or worse, you are our only hope. I can tell you, though. There are flying monsters at the eastern cliffs of the Rising Beach that are capable of improved flying. So all I have to do is get out, uh, get one of those and beat your art. Which will probably help them, right? Even if it's just not uh, leaving or leaving the hunter, it would be just cool. Improved flying. Maybe we can find a way to evolve one of our normal flying monsters so they can fly higher. Well, oof, 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 oof. Alright, let's uh... What was I looking for? Arm gel. That's the arm gel. I kind of wish you can set which spot they're in so you don't have to search for them every time. I know where Koi is at, at the very least. So we we'll use the most. Seems like we can. This place is suspicious, isn't it? That matches the clue, doesn't it? Take street entry to Maw's Beast, wasn't it? Something like that. I already tried those switches on the ground, though. Nothing seems to work. Spring rocks in them definitely doesn't help. At least the clue is meant to say we need three people. Maybe there's somebody else around who can help us. I saw Leonard a bit early around here. He was in the cage, it's above us. Maybe you can find him. There and convince him to work with us. I know that can be tough since he's always so cool himself. Maybe beating him in a old fashioned keeper will do the trick. Oh, we're fighting Leonard. Okay. Is that the regular color for the Spectral Wolf? I think so, obviously. Cannot fight against the current, no matter how hard we try. I don't want to go down. Man, this looks like a secret if I could go down there. 
Nope, it's not. Hello, monsters. Gino. Jesus. Look at that. He's really broken. TPH. He just doesn't do much damage, but. The shields, man. The shields. Firestorm, see if we can get that, uh, those burns going. And then Thunderstorm, level two. Now they're on half health. We should be able to finish them off next turn. Ow, he hurt. We still should potentially just be able to capture them, even with that uh, our guy being that low level. Swarm level three. If it crits, we kill them all. If it doesn't crit, we have to wait another turn. Oh, we killed them all. And we didn't get the freaking koi egg. Oh, what's the space egg? I'm melted. Go down now. Let's see what's here. More secrets. Oh, it's a chest down there. Switch there too. Chest right here. Shore gem. When are we supposed to go to this area? Seems kind of. Resources are kind of bad, honestly. He doesn't control you. He, he, there's a freaking thigh in my room too. It's annoying the fuck out of me. I'm about to turn on my fan. Just for a little bit. Ah, uh, so I'm about to get up. Sit on the chair. Turn on my fan for a little bit. There you go. You guys can't hear my fan, which is a good thing. Good, good just like that. Diadem for It's not bad. So oh, we definitely can't go anywhere here anymore, so let's go to the right again. Let's go to the right again. Let's go to the right again. It's actually really nice, I like it. Nice and upbeat. This one doesn't contain anything, doesn't look like. Ooh, 
secrets to be found down there. Oh, we gotta go all the way over here. I think I may end this early, TBH. I've been playing a lot of this game in recent memory. Like a lot of it. I need to take me a break. Play off this game though, TBH. It's actually rather fun. Okay, okay, make sure. I think whenever he takes a step on actual, like, the toppies. We'll just call it here. Use that time to stream some of the games, get some sleep, all that good stuff. I am quite tired. TV8. I'm not even sure where I'm going anymore. I'll try to stay up a little bit to see if I can. Where am I even supposed to be going anymore? Hey, I remember, I remember. Sorry. Being tired is affecting. So. Alright. Let's go down here. We need to go down here to the right. Gotcha. Then we go into this little area right there. This is a secret for sure. Big potion. Okay, we need koi. See what's here. Oh, so you can get more koi here. That's awesome. Choose monsters. You're in. Probably gets the gun off in the other house. You guys can put this. Tough earthquake, do a little bit of damage to everybody. Uh, firestorm, spread the fire damage around. We have two stacks of poison already. Three stacks of poison. Oh god. I think we stumbled on the wrong enemy. Yeah. Yeah, we, we really did. We got a shield. It's still gonna take four turns though. Three turns. Five stacks of poison. If he didn't shield right there, we would probably be dead this turn. They're broken. What are we even supposed to do about these enemy types? To believe poison is something stupid like 10% of your maximum health. And we got a thorn to save. Let me check on that real quick. I told, uh, what's her face? Curly Q. It does 10% of maximum. Ah, oh, go back. There you go. I have no idea what that was, but hopefully it was worth it. Here we are stepping on actual grass. Let's fight these enemies right here. And then we'll save.
Monster Bell. I had a strange feeling that we could do that. We need to catch one of these guys. Ziviato. Oh, these are the evolved form of Vario. What happens if you evolve a shifted monster? Is that even a thing? Got one burn out of the entire deal. That I guess. So maybe we get an evolution shard, some kind. Fire on another enemy now. Yes, perfect level two. And then it's to blast. They could potentially kill them all. If only the other one had a stack of fire on them, it would have been good. Ow. Got what we needed. Better level four, quick chance. Not bad, not bad at all. Crit ring. Let's defeat these guys. Okay. I'm not even sure what I want to play, I'm not even sure I want to play anything to gauge. I'm rather tired, but I want to stay up to at least 10 and stream more. It's not every day I get to stream without being bothered by talking about. If we can get more fire stacks or burn stacks. Oh yeah, I think they're all dying. If it crits, we kill them all. If it doesn't crit, we don't kill them all. He's gonna die at the fire. Oh, I guess he didn't die at the fire, I was wrong. Oh well, we can just finish him off with an explosion. That's right. We, can we really not finish him off in one hit? Maybe we can get another Dodo Egg. Bird and Gem, Rawhide. I... Oh, well, this is where we're gonna end right now. Rather tired. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like and subscribe. It helps the more you know, but it's entirely up to you. And if you have any suggestions for future videos, just let me know down in the comments. But until then, I'll see everyone in the next part of my Let's Play of Monster Sanctuary. I actually wonder how long I've been streaming this game overall, how long I've been playing. I've done multiple two-hour streams of this game. I would say it's somewhere around 20 hours. So that means I've essentially got 20 episodes of this game already. But I'm going to have to start uploading to YouTube so I don't lose any of it. But yeah, I'll see everyone later.